Hello everybody and welcome to this morning's live Facebook workout. Um, hope there's going to be a few people joining us this morning or watching this later. Uh, we've got a really challenging shorter workout today. I'm getting my timings better. So we're going to start marching in place, get ourselves warmed up. It's a lot cooler here in the UK this morning. It feels more like the UK, the rain's here, the wind. But we have been very lucky with all the sunshine that we've had. So as you can see we're wearing tops this morning because it feels a bit cooler but I'm sure they'll be taken off shortly. Let's just keep that marching in place, using them arms, swinging away. For those of you first time joining us, I'm Paul and this is Helen, we're from Mind Gift. And we're going to help you get fit both in your mind and your body. And today, the first exercises we're going to be doing is a full 17 minute cardio hit workout. So, quite challenging, but we've got some variations for you. Let's get some leg swings in. So, nice and controlled to start with. If you need to balance, that's fine, as we always say. As your leg warms up, we want to try and twist that torso to touch that foot. So, we're going to be doing 17 minutes of cardio and we're only doing four exercises in that 17 minutes. So the first round, we're going to start with the toughest, is going to be a minute of each exercise. Then we're going to have a 20 second rest and then we're going to do 50 seconds, 20 second rest, then we're going to switch over. Then we're going to do 40 seconds, same to 30 seconds, same to 20 seconds and same to 10. And I'll go over them four exercises with you in a minute. Just want to make sure we're fully warmed up as we get into the cardio. And then after that we've got six exercises where we're going to focus on strength. And you'll probably only need a couple of tins and a couple of light dumbbells for them. For probably one of the exercises or a couple of the exercises on that to go with. Okay, let's do some of them slow jacks. Really loosen up them arms and shoulders legs if you're feeling a bit warmer you can just nice and light start the full jack Okay, let's do another 10 seconds here. We're going to go into the Muay Thai knees. Three, two, one. Ow. <laughs> okay, remember that? Okay, I'm going to back a bit. An angle. Really stretch them arms up. Keep that breathing, really push that knee up to your hands. Okay, and switch sides. That's it, push it up. In five, four, three, two and one. So make sure them shoulders are fully warmed up, so get some nice rolls. Nice small circles forward and back. Okay, nice and big. That's it. Swing that all the way forward and all the way back. A few at a time. And forward, and back. Okay, let's get some body weight squats in. So, shoulder width apart, sit down, squeeze your bum at the top. Remember, we're just warming up, so we're going to loosen up before these first exercises. I'll go through all four of them shortly. 
So like I said, we're going to do a minute of each of these to start with and there's no rest in between the first four exercises but then we get a 20 second rest before we go on to 50 seconds of each. So if you're carrying on with Helen, you can do some squats, you maybe do some lunges, some small lunges just to carry on. I'll show you the exercises. So the first exercise, I'm going to do our standard mountain climbers on the floor or you've got the option of doing them standing. Again, if you're, you don't want to do any bouncing, just really power up that knee and that arm. So that's the first one. Then we've got a burpee. Depends on how you're feeling this morning. So we can go down, we can do the full push up and up, or we can just go down, step back, step in and lengthen. The other version of that we're going to do is a walkout. If you're with Helen, so we're going to walk out and then walk back and lengthen. What we can do is if you don't want to get down on the floor, we're just going to do some tin punches while we're doing leg raises, like so. And then we're going to do a switch, switch, drop squat. So it's switch, switch, drop, drop, drop. Okay, and you can do that slower, tapping and down. Okay, and then the last one, regular jumping jacks, get our heart rate a little bit coming down at the end. And again, I'm going to do that slower. I'm warmed up now, so let's get started. Are you good to go? Yeah. Okay. So in 10 seconds, we're going to start. I'm going to start with me on the floor, or you're going to be with Helen doing the standing. And we're going to be starting in 10 seconds. Start my watch. Okay, so floor mountain climbers, if you're with me, if you're with Helen, you got standing. Okay, let's go. I don't know why my uh, trusted timer is not speaking this morning. Just keep going. Just keep going. So 60 seconds of this should be. Yep. Oh. He's going back to the beginning, I'm not sure I am going to alright, keep going. Okay, you sure? Yeah, we'll be fine. Right, we're just starting again, don't worry about it, I'm sure you can do it. So, if you want to just march it out, I think we've, uh, we're on Take the Take a level. pause if you're on the floor. Okay. Oh, it's been really easy that minute. Okay, wrist and line your shoulders. Try and keep your knees low to the ground if you're with me. Really important you keep your breath regulated with this. Arms nice and strong. If anyone's kept going and they're now tired, just march. We'll have a quick stretch because we're going into burpees if you're with me. If you're with Helen, you're going into walkouts. Yeah. Or tin punches. So if you don't want to get on the floor, get your tins. Okay, and guys. Let's go. I'm going to do the first round just as a normal burpee. Remember, you can just step back. Well done, keep going. Remember them tin punches. Use your knees, march up and down. Okay, we've got 25 seconds of this. Okay, come on, last 10. We're in some switch, switch, drop spots. Last one. Okay, let's go. One, so tap, two. Tap, squat. Tap, tap, squat. Try and remember to switch legs if you can. Each time. Okay, 
Alright, oh, mate, should be coming up now. Over halfway. Get into them heels. Go back to a tap. I mean, it's a long time if you ever hard work on this round, I think, yeah? Yeah, this is the hardest one. 10 seconds, I'm ready to jump in jacks. Okay, let's do it. You go forward a bit. That's it. So do it slowly. Or with pace. If you purse your lips a little bit, just breathe out. Help slow your heart rate down a little. Halfway for that nice 20 second rest. Keep going, come on. Fifteen seconds. In five, four, three, two, and one. First round done. Morning, Mum. Morning, Josie. Just move that camera back a little bit if I can. Okay, let's set this up. 50 seconds. So the good news is we're going down in time now. So as we go work through this, it feels easier. So yep. 50 seconds now. Same thing, but 50 seconds, not six strokes. Okay, 10 seconds. Down to the floor for me. Standing Come out climbers. Quick stretch. Okay, let's do it. Remember, knees nice and low to the ground. Wrists in line with your shoulders. Looking straight down, take your neck. I'll let Helen give you a shout on the time. Halfway. Run into them burpees next or walkouts. 15 seconds. Okay. So you can do the punches with the team or walk out. If you want to do the push up with these guys, please feel free. But I warn you, we've got push ups coming up later on. Part of the strength. Okay, we've got. 20 seconds. Come on, let's go. Last 10. What can you do? One more. Well done. Okay, let's switch. And drop. So tap, tap. Or switch. Come on, twenty seconds to go. In some jumping jacks. Nice twenty second rest. After this, after the jack, sorry. Okay, into jacks. Yeah, and you can just step out of the jacks. Awful. Whatever pace 
bench like. Let's get them hands touching at the top of you with me. Well done everybody so far. Down to the 40 second round after this. Gets easier. Ten seconds, come on, power it out. Well done. Twenty seconds, take a drink. Morning, Johnny. So same again, but forty seconds. Then thirty seconds, then twenty seconds, then ten seconds. <clears throat> okay. Take a drink if you need it. Should be making sure you're hydrated. We got 10 seconds. We're down for the floor, are you with me? So walking, climbers, or running, standing climbers. Let's go. Only 40 seconds. Last ten. Oh, oh. Okay. Switch. So tap, tap, squat, or switch. Well, we're over halfway. Jumping jacks. Three, two, one. <clears throat> okay. Step them out if you need to. Remember if you purse them lit and you blow it out. Halfway. Keep going, come on. Last ten, let's pump it up. Three, two, one. Great job. <coughs> Deep breaths in three nose out of three mouth. Set that time to 30. Sweats so come in now. A couple of deep breaths. And the sun's coming out. Okay, 10 seconds. Are you down with me? About 10 climbers. Walking climbers. Running climbers. <clears throat> okay, let's do it. 30 seconds. Don't hold your breath. Come 
Come on. Three, two, one. Okay. Four counts on punches. Burpees. Come on, ten seconds. One more. Okay, switch and drop. Tap, tap, squat. Remember, just marching in place over them 10 punches. Or just the slower version for this one. You choose what's right for you. Jumping jacks. Stepping out jacks or jumping. Come on, 30 seconds. Only two more rounds after this. Before we go to strength. Yep. It's not the end. <laughs> is it the beginning? Or is it? Uh. Okay. 20 Ten seconds. seconds. Coming up. Yes, quicker and quicker. Give us a shout out if you're on. Even if you're watching in bed. Looking at us struggling. Give us a shout. Say hello. Okay, 10 seconds. Only 20 second rounds, these. For these climbers, so we'll shout out what, what's coming up. Give it what you can. Let's go. 20 seconds, it goes really quick. Burpees up, workouts next. All the punches. Okay, go. on your feet. Let's go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, let's switch. Step, squat. Sweating, good towel. Jumping jacks next. Finish strong. Okay. So step them or jump. Come on, 10 seconds, let's go. Good job. Okay, now it's the crazy round. Ten seconds. Ten seconds on each, so quick turnaround. Or just shout out, or just do your best. It is a quick turnaround. A couple of deep breaths in three nose out three mouth. Okay, we're going in ten seconds. Give it everything you've got this time. The climbers. Let's do it. So burpees or workouts is coming up any second. <laughs> Ten punches. Change. Let's get up. One. Two. Three. Four. Let's get another one. Four. Five. Squat it. Switch. Jumping jacks to finish. Okay, let's do it. Come on, stand. Hey! Great job, well done. Well done, guys. 
Okay, take a minute's rest. Take some water, take a towel. Woo! That's so you much. might need a couple of tins or dumbbells for the strength, is that right? Yep. <clears throat> okay, so we've got two, four, six, eight, twelve. We're doing two rounds of each of these. 30 seconds with a 15 second rest, yeah? Yeah. Around twice. Six exercises, 30 seconds each, and then we'll go around again. Okay, we got regular push ups to start, <clears throat> either on your knees, remember keeping our elbows in, or full push ups. Which is it, this one? Quality over quantity, yeah, just, just, a, press. just a press. Just a straight forward press. Standing press if you don't want to get down on the floor. Or you can do them, or, do them hammer style. Or do them against, leaning against the wall as we've shown you yep. before. Then we're going to use our dumbbells, nice wide stance, and we're going to do alternating plank rows. Or if you don't want to get down, do standing. Standing rows. Yeah, make sure that back's flat like Helms was then. Then we've got dips, which we all know. And if you can't get down, if you've not got a chair, use your dumbbells for a tricep press. Yeah, if you've got a chair, you can get a little bit deeper, but these are tough enough just to do them off the floor. And then we've got swimmers for our lower back. So we're going to be doing alternating, or you can just do them both together. We want to look at down at the floor, and that is going to feel in your lower back to strengthen it. Just remind me if we're not going down like that. So we're going to do arm circles. Like so, with a weight, with the tins if you can, that's, that's going to be tough. That's going to be really hard, that with a weight, I can feel it in my own arms. Yeah, and then we've got walkouts, what we what you did on that last round. But we're going to walk out, add a squat thrust, and a push up, and then walk back. Or if you just want to do side to side taps in a plank position, you can do. Or if you want to, you can walk off the chair. So walking back, I'm walking up. Walking back, I'm walking up. Okay, and then the last one we've got, somebody told me this was their favorite, holding two bells or two tins, and we're gonna switch side to side for our core, working our obliques. Okay, enough talking, 10 seconds, and we're starting with them push-ups. Two rounds of each, by the way, 15 we'll seconds you, rest. We'll get you tins, and we'll do a press. Okay, down, up, down, up, quality over quantity please. Already 15 in, 15 to go. Elbows nice and close, if you can, don't flare them out. Okay, I'm going into my child's pose to stretch my shoulders. When I have that 15 seconds rest, one more round of these. Okay. Oh, sorry, you're doing two. Yeah, two, two, two again. I thought we were going home. My mistake, so back to the press again. Okay, let's go. Down, squeeze. Again, don't be feared if you need to go onto your knees. I prefer to do that for the form, if that's what you need to do. Build your strength up to eventually get to the full push up. We've only got 10 seconds. We're going to grab them dumbbells, tins, whatever you've got. Okay, going into them plank rows for your back, just Ball on the chest. Standing. Straight back, yep. Nice wide feet with these. Hand row. It's important to not keep nice and stable in that plank. None of this swinging. Elbow close to your body. So hips should be staying straight. Yeah. Not rocking about. You can do this without weights, just flat hand, bring it up. 
Again, I'll go for my stretch, my child's pose. The rest comes around, goes around very quickly. Five seconds. Okay, let's do it. Row. Control it. Going in some tricep dips next. Full tricep press. You got your tins or your weights. Well done. So hands up like this. You might just want to use one of your tins as opposed to both your weights with this. Especially when you get to the second round. Okay, we've got dips. Bum in the air. Bend make, them elbows. And make sure if you're standing that your knees are slightly bent. Don't just drop your bum. You've got to bend them elbows, squeeze the triceps at the top, at the top, at the top. <laughs> Should feel that if you're with me. Obviously, we, he doesn't think we should be feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you are. Okay, one more round with them. Before we're going face down, even with me, we're doing them swimmers to the lower back after this. Okay, five seconds, we're back into these dips. Just important with this, just to remember that you're fully extending your arms up and down. You're not just sort of swinging them around you. It's a control movement to get the best out of it. And look at Helen's bent knee there. That supports the lower back. Really important, squeezing your core. It's like bending the knee. 10 seconds. Been trained well. Took a while though. <laughs> Cheeky bugger. Okay, flipping over to them swimmers. Okay, so you can do alternate foot. Or the arm circles. Or we can do them both together. And what I'm saying out loud now that uh, this with the weight is really tough. I don't think I can do it, hold it out for two rounds or 30 seconds. So see where you're at. If you're with me, I want you to squeeze your bum at the top. You will feel it in your lower back, that's okay. It's a strengthening exercise. Remember, I've had back surgery and this was one of the things that exercise that helped me with my lower back. I'm looking down at the mat. Squeeze. Or alternate. Oh yeah, that's tough. So I'm going to try the alternating this time, which is a lot harder than doing them both together. So I'm going to be like so, as if I'm front crawl swimming. So okay. arm circles again. You can do forward or back. So I'm going back this time. Make sure your arms are nice and strong. No weights for me this time. Still can feel it. A lot harder, feel like on your shoulders too, so I'm going back to doubles. Squeeze your bum at the top. Okay. We've got walkouts with a squat thrust and a push up. You with me? So I'm going to do tap. I'm going to do those walking up taps, but we can do them. You can walk in and out like Paul said. Okay, I'm walking out. Squat thrust and push up. Go down to your knees if you need to for the push up. You need to feel a little bit quicker with these. Especially with 30 seconds. And lengthen all the way up when you stand. Okay, can we get one more? Okay, one more round of them. Okay, get ready in three, two, one. Let's go, walk it out. Squat thrust, push up. Lengthen, walk it out.
Okay, let's get one more. Great job. Pick up your dumbbells or your tins. Morning, Anita. Morning, John. So, you can just use one again. You don't need to use both. Okay, twist. Twist. How you go with them dumbbells, the harder it is. And you are also, you can drop the weight. I'm just grabbing, clasping my hands with the two. Rest 15 seconds. Starting to feel light on my core and my shoulders. Okay, one more round before we have a break. And we have to do it all again. Yay! I thought. <laughs> oh, okay. totally. I'm not, in, I'm not following this here. Well, I thought it was breakfast time. I did. You said two rounds and I've done two. That's why I put that big repeating capital on the bottom. Blind, guys. He's pushing his luck here. Ten seconds, come on. Well done. Take a rest, take some water. Great job. We're at 29 minutes. Doing well for time. Uh, don't know when you put your timer on, but we're on 37 on mine. You just try and get extra calories, don't you? Uh, I don't know when you turned your time. I started around. as we were just about to work out. You must have started at the warm up. <laughs> it all counts. Arguments brewing. I can oh feel it. Oh my god, seriously. <laughs> the timing issue continues. It's all a case of perception, my love. Apparently, the warm up doesn't count. You, I know you, you've all told me you want to do more anyway, so. Okay. <sighs> Couple of deep breaths. I'm going back into some push ups. Or you've got your dumbbell or tin press. Or, or your push-ups on your knees, okay? Let's go in 10 seconds. This is it, this is it. Six exercises, two of each. Let's finish it off. Push-ups. All the press with the dumbbells. All without the dumbbell. If it's getting tougher. Okay, that was 11 for me. I felt they were good form, good pace, not too fast, not too slow. One more round. Try and count your numbers, but keep the form, really important. Ten seconds. Come on. Can I get it? Oh, that's tough. Eleven. Oh. That was hard. Oh yeah. Okay, plank rows. Oh. We dumbbells. Standing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Wide feet. Let's roll it out. Control it. Keep going. Well done. Fifteen seconds, one more go of these. Yeah, it's tough going. You can always tell when I don't speak as much when I'm doing the exercise. Okay, let's finish this last one. Remember, you can do this without the weight. Plant your hands on the floor. 
Nice strong core with this. No twisting. Nearly there. Okay, we've got dips. Or oh, the tricep press, one way or two is fine. One way or another. One weight. Oh, one weight <laughs> or it's another. In my accent, is it? Okay. Bend them elbows, squeeze at the top. There's lots of people over 50 do this today, like myself. Anybody can do it once they train themselves up to it and do these variations. Get stronger, gain muscle. The more calories, the more muscle you have. Like I always say, it's not just cardio. Add the strength in as well. Really important. Can I ask permission to have bicep curls in my next round, please? You can. Oh, instead of those arm circle ones that were a Yeah. Kid. The boss has spoken. You know how I like a bicep. Squeeze them out. 10 seconds. Go into some swimmers nets for our lower back. If you can get down and do that, then obviously give it a go. It is good for your back. Okay, we're switching over. That one's going to go a bit heavier with these. Okay, we're swimming. Or if you can't get down or you've got back troubles, go with the bicep curl. So I'm going to go doubles to start for the first round. Squeeze. Slight pause at the top, one second, and then drop. Feet come up, arms, hands come up. If that's too much, you can just do one foot, one hand at a time. Squeeze, alternating. And now I'll try a variation. Another variation that you can do is keep your feet up and do some breaststroke. Lots of variations for this if you look them up. Okay, so I'm doing alternating swimmers. Okay, when that gets too much for my back, I'll have a pause and I'll go back into doubles. And I'll try a few feet up. Well done. We've got that walkouts so with a squat thrust and push up. Are you with me? So you can do this walkout off a wall, yeah? Is that right? Yeah. And yeah. stand up. I'm going to do the uh, plank taps, squat thrust and push up, lengthen all the way up as you stand up, if you're with me make sure you're holding your core in and your back is flat, yeah nice flat back there, lengthen all the way up, Oh, I'll just do one walkout to finish. Okay, one more round. We're nearly there. Okay, let's do it. Eight seconds. What you got? Tough one. Come on guys, get one more. Well done. Okay, last one. Two extra two rounds. Okay, we've got them crunches side to side with your dumbbells, your tins. I'm 
clasping my hands like so if you've got dumbbells like this. Come on, you've done so well. Last two exercises. You've done brilliant today. I'll let you have a glass of wine tonight as a treat. Or one beer. <laughs> Twirl. Yeah, you've got twirl lined up today. <laughs> I'll certainly be having a cabris twirl. I might have two ears later. Okay, last one, guys. This is it. Finish, and then we're curling down. Okay, let's do it. Come on, big crunch. Should feel them shoulders after all them push ups. 15 seconds. Come on, let's go. Three, two, one. Brilliant job. Well done. Great job, everybody. Take some water, take a towel. Well done, well done guys, high five, great job, morning Dave, great to have you watching, hope you're doing not just watching, forty minutes on my clock, yeah forty seven on mine, <laughs> forty, forty's right, take the warm up, the warm up off, <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's get cooled down, Okay, just loosening out, let's stretch them shoulders, remember that arm across, looking over that shoulder, we're stretching, we want to be feeling, remember the other variation is with your hands like so, okay, loosen out, and switch sides, that's it. You should feel that stretch right in that shoulder. If not, pull on that arm. On that hand, sorry. Real good sweat fest start for me. Hope it was for you. No matter what variation you're doing, you're doing it. You're doing it to the best of your ability and that's all I can ask. Okay, let's stretch them triceps. Palm around the middle of the back of your head, back of your neck. Pull on that elbow, really feel that stretch. In that tricep. Keep your breathing going in through your nose, out through your mouth. Let's get that heart rate back down. Okay, switch sides. Loosen out, more towel. Okay, at least it's uh, drying up outside in sunny Warrington. I know my mum's over and dad are over in Spain in nearly 40 degree heat, bless them. Okay, loosen it out, loosen them shoulders. Okay, we're gonna do that back shoulder stretch. So I'm gonna pull my belly button in, round my back, push out. That's too much, just press out and I'm standing and really push them hands out. Don't want anyone with a sore lower back. Pull that belly button in. Really push, you're not feeling that, really extend them shoulders. Okay, loosen out. Okay, let's do them quads. Remember, if you need your balance, just grab the back of your shoe. Or if you can, grab the back of your foot and balance, great. If not, I'll show you the variation you can do. On the floor with this one, knees halfway up. And I'm gonna pull that quad. Pulling my heel to my bum, pushing my knee back. 
a nice deep stretch. Some people feel that this is get more of a stretch out of that than the standing. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. I'll stay down, I will show you the other one. Okay, so knees at 90 degrees on the other leg. I rest my arm on my, my head on my arm, I really pull back. Nice deep stretch. You should feel it, but it shouldn't be mega painful. If you're standing, the key is keep your knees together. Don't be splaying your leg out to the side like that. Knees together and pull as much as you can. But again, then you're not tipping forward. Oh, there's a lot to remember. Five, four, three, two, one. One of the things I always ask people that are trained is always practice your balance. So let's put our one, our arms out, put one foot up, and that's great. You should feel them little muscles in our ankles. They're the ones we want to strengthen as we get older. Saves our trips and falls. Now, if you really want to push it, just close your eyes. So your ankles should go a little bit more crazy, and that's okay. You might fall over, but great one to practice. You can do this holding a chair to start with. Switch to the other leg, so put it out, keep your eyes open. Looking straight ahead. And when you're comfortable, try and close your eyes. So you'll feel the ankle wants to do a lot more moving. Yeah, and it's okay. You fall to one side, practice this. Great thing as we're getting older. Okay, so we're going to do that good morning stretch. So remember this one. So bend, bend my right leg, my left leg straight out, my toes pointing up. I'm going to push down on this quad muscle as I bring that toe up, rather than doing this bend down, which a lot of people do around the back. Really pull, pull that toe towards you to get the deepness of the stretch of your calf, up your hamstring. Give us a thumbs up if you like the workout. Changing sides. I always appreciate anybody's comments. Anything they want to see different or they're happy with these workouts and please leave us a, a message. Keeps us motivated to keep doing them at the moment. Okay, really pull that toe up. Don't forget Helen's video on our YouTube channel, Mind Gift. Uh, just put out on Thursday the instruction manual for your mind part five. So please go and check them out. Helps keep your brain in check as well, whilst we're keeping your body in check on this Saturday morning. Well done, everybody. Thank you for joining us. We're going to enjoy our breakfast now. Well done. Have nice a nice coffee. You. Thanks for being have, with us. Have a great weekend. Stay Bye. safe. Look after.